Hi, Tony and Rose Kitchen again and again. I've got a habit to say I bake them, but I do not bake them. I fry them in oil just to make sure that I say the right thing. Sometimes I forget because sometimes I bake them too in the oven. So, so I did not bake this. I fry them. Look at the color of the, the um, aret. The pastry is second to none. Remember, we used to make it plain flour. And then I find that put some cup with, with three cups of plain flour and a cup of self-rising flour, it puffs up the pastry and it stays softer, you know? And, and with the plain flour, they come too flat. So I always like, and I put a bit of yellow coloring, food coloring, and have a look at the color of the amaret. Now, the thing is, what you need to do, you make sure you don't put the oil too high, please. Please, boil it slowly on medium-low. Between the medium-low, but don't put it too high. And don't fry them too quick. Because if you fry them too quick, what happens? It will fry the top, but it will leave the inside raw. Have a look at the color, and you tell, if you tell me that this color of them are, it is not wonderful, I like to know. Okay? The dates is full, beautiful, very nice, absolutely very nice. Okay? The pastry is second to none, believe me. You try it with plain flour and self-rising flour, and you will not be sorry. They came so because... With the self-rising flour, the, the, um, the pastry puffs up when you, when you fry them in oil. Okay, they are very nice. I just tasted one before, but I'm not having another one because I'm having the macaroni tonight with the kids for their mother, first year anniversary. I wish my wife was here because you know what she would say to me about the amaret? Oh, Tony, you do good things. That's what she used to tell me, you know. Yeah, that's what she used to tell me. When I bake or cook something, she always say, Tony, gee, you're a good cook, huh? And, I, and it was the most beautiful pleasure to hear that from my wife. I don't care about somebody else, whether they like them or not. But as long as my wife used to like what I cook, that's all it concerned me. But for you not to like this, I don't know what can you like. Pastry color, as I told you, with that yellow food coloring, have a look at that. Have a look at that. Isn't that beautiful color for the Amaret? You say to yourself now, yes, Tony. This is Tony and Rose Kitchen. All I ask from you people, I teach you what I can, I teach you what I know. Some like it, maybe some don't, but the one who likes it, please pray for my wife. Please, her name is Lourdes Rosie. I call her Rosie because where she used to work, she had rose cheek. So the people who she worked with, they said, we're not going to call you Lords because in here they call you Lourdes. They said, we're going to call you Rosie for your rosy rose cheeks that you've got. She was so fine. Her skin was so beautiful. Okay. Thank you very much. I hope you enjoy. I hope you make them. Remember again, please do not put the oil high. Once it, you see tiny bubbles, on medium-low, throw them at it. Cook them slowly, one side, and then turn them on the other side. And the color is absolute. Thank you kindly. Tony and Rose Kitchen, love you all. Love to teach you. And your feedback has always been tremendous. And from the bottom of my heart, i like to thank you. Me and my wife, she would like to thank you. Thank you.